they might notice that the hottest part of that fire um, to their eyes would appear uh, as what we know today as being yellow. And then they would might notice that uh, as those coals began to cool down, they began to change color towards oranges and towards reds and even in, in the edges there towards purples. As we're standing in the middle of a snow-covered landscape, we feel the cold or our, our eyes are observing the blue colors. The colors associated with blue end up being on the cool side of the color wheel and those associated with uh, yellows, oranges, and reds are on the warm side of the wheel. Now we want to put all this together into a process of studying warm and cool from this reference. I hope that you will pay more attention to the process than you are to the fact that I'm painting. I'm moving over to the next value. Next value of green right here and maybe some of that middle value. So just put that right there. Now I'm looking at those moderate shadows and I'm seeing that those moderate shadows too are a little cooler and a little more neutral. So I'll move into that value right here. Same value line. Move into the that value of the neutral and I'll move into that value of the cool. And there you go, there's the warmth. Let's pick up some cool. Here you go, there's the cool. Pick up some more warm. Right in here, there we go, there's some warm. Warm, cool, warm, cool. Warm, cool, warm, cool. And that has to do very much with, with the temperature, with warm and cold, with how we see warm and cold. And those light rays also have a lot to do with neutrality, with uh, how things get neutralized as they move into distance. So, we we'll throw a little bit more light up in here, and you can see I made it a little bit, uh, it's actually a little bit cooler. We're painting in the direct light source here. So I talked a lot about the direct light source and what the light rays are doing, how they too can affect the temperature, and then the temperature of light and shadow. Now here, we didn't, uh, we're mostly working in light there, but we were keeping the overall feeling, this is cool, we're keeping the overall feeling of warm, while within it we had a lot of cool, warm, cool, warm, cool, warm going on, where we're still allowing the warm, would be the predominant color or predominant feeling that we saw in the whole thing. 